Hi everyone, I'm IFBB Pro Alex Carnero. And I'm Charles Glass. And we're both part of Team Optimum. Today we're going to be talking about my abdominal workout. And also talking about Platinum Hydroway. As pros, we know what really goes behind the scenes. We're going to be showing to you guys a three-dimensional workout that goes beyond sit-ups and crunches. And Charles and I are going to reveal the secret to the pros where you can't find anywhere else. Make sure you follow through what Alex is doing, and then you'll find your true strength. Today, what we're going to do is Roman chair bent leg leg raises. Why? Because we're going to focus on the lower abs. We're trying to keep everything tight in here. Most of us have that problem right down here, and we want to work it hard. Here we go. Ready? We're trying to keep all the tension where? Here, on the lower abs. Knees are slightly bent, back against the pad, and we're breathing in and out. Make sure you exhale as you go up. Inhale when your legs come down. Nice. Ready? Stop. If you notice, all the tension was applied to where? Lower abs. Now we're gonna do an advanced version. We're gonna keep the legs straight, back against the pad, and you're gonna move it up and down the same manner. Now, we also can add weight to make it even tougher. It gets tougher and it makes the abs stand out a little bit more. We're gonna do cable rope crunches. We're gonna pull and contract into the upper abs, squeezing, blowing the air out, coming up very slow, nice and consistent, trying to focus on nothing but the upper abs and the upper obliques. All right, a lot of people stand close, but we're gonna stand back about one to two feet, back straight, hands in the position to pull, ready? Crunch it over, contract and wear. Upper abs, upper oblique. Anywhere from 12 to 15 reps. A slight variation, but more advanced technique is sitting on the floor. They sit the same, about maybe a foot away. It's more of a concentration here. Everything is concentrated on here. What? The crunch is right there in the center. Less movement, more concentrated. Now we're gonna do the Russian twist, or better known as what? The windshield wiper. We're gonna lie on the floor, we have our feet, feet are going to go straight up. Now we're going to swing from side to side, only moving the hips. Good. Pausing in the center, dropping it all the way over. You never touch the floor, you only move from side to side. There you go, good. Blow it out, ready? That's it, contract as you get there. Come on. Pause it, drop. Good, perfect. Now for the advanced version, we're going to do a hanging version. You want to get your body what? In a 45 degree angle. You can move from side to side, same procedure. Don't lose that. Staying tight, not turning the torso, but only moving the hips. What we're gonna do is cable side crunch. All we're working is the obliques. What we're gonna do is get the arm in a 90 degree angle, drive the elbow down to the knee, pausing at the bottom, and releasing. Locking everything in so why? It just doesn't fly up. Keep that motion going. Make sure you stretch from the obliques. Here we go. Ready? Blowing the air out. There you go. Squeeze. That's it. Holding that form. Nice, slow tempo. That's it. Anywhere from 15 to 20 reps. A more advanced version of the same thing. Elbow still in the 90 degree. Concentrating on what? Contracting in, lifting the leg off the floor to meet. Also, twist that body just a hair so you can get that nice, compact feel. Now we're going to go decline crunch. What we're going to do, we're going to sit on the bench, face up. Grabbing the handle, and then all we're gonna do is make sure we get our glutes off the pad, bringing our knees toward the face. All right, ready bring it up, good. That's it. You notice how he brings it and he lifts, making sure those glutes come off the pad. There you go. Good, perfect. Bring it up, push, good. Make sure everything is medium weight. Don't go real fast. If you go too fast, what happens, you end up losing it and you put more pressure on your upper abs. Now we're gonna do the advanced version. Lie back in the same position, but you're gonna to try to keep the movement going. And you're not gonna bring your knees to your face, but you're gonna bring them halfway in, but push back out. So you always stand up in the air, extending out. You're gonna do the wood chopper. And what this is, is you're reaching across. Your arms are perfectly straight, going across the body. As you turn, your feet are staggered. You're reaching all the way across. Completion, pause in the exercise. Here we go, ready? Don't move those hips, only move the upper torso. Ready? Good, there you go. When you move just the upper torso, what happens? All works there, obliques. If you notice, he's watching his arm movement. That way your body stays perfect. There you go, good. Exhale, good. 
We have two slight variations of the wood chopper. It's more of an advanced movement. One starting from the top, going down, and the other one from the bottom, going up. A lot of people try to use their arms to pull, but it's not that. You lock in position, and you still move it down. You know it's only what? It's torso moving, not the hips. They're locked in place. Good. You know, I've tried numerous proteins in the past, but I've never found one that settles with me more than this. Simply because of the process of going into this. Platinum Hydra Whey is ON's fastest, purest, most advanced whey protein. Each serving delivers 30 grams of fast-acting whey protein and 8.8 .8 grams of muscle-building BCAAs with just 140 calories per serving. I use it every day. Yeah, this is the best for me.